It's said that time is money. The meaning behind the statement is that time is valuable. And it's when we own our time, we own our life. Each week, 168 valuable hours are given to you. But let's subtract from that sleep time. If you take the average six to eight hours per night, this leaves you with 112 to 126 hours each week. Now sleep is something we all have to do, but it's also something we all love to do. And that leads me right into the point of this video. How much of your time do you own to spend on doing what you love, when you want, and where you want? Whether it's traveling, a hobby, hanging out with friends and family, volunteering, whatever it is you love doing, how much of your time do you own? Better yet, how much of your time does someone else own? Because aside from sleeping, a major portion of your time is spent working. Now, unless you love your job and you do it even if you had a million dollars, then these are hours that you do not own because owned hours are hours spent doing what you love, when you want, and where you want. So here's what I'm gonna have you do next. Pause the video, grab pen and paper, and figure out how many hours you dedicate to your job each week. Each week. This should include drive time, to and from, uh, any mandatory meetings, any work brought home, just anything that is related to work. And for you, this might even mean time spent thinking about your job. So go ahead and pause the video and figure that out now. Okay, so that number is the amount of your time that is owned by someone else. Now, how much you get paid to not own your time in life? <laughs> well, that's a whole other video. But for now, you're going to pause the video again and subtract that number from either 112 or 126, whichever one of those better represents how much time you have left after you take out sleep time. So go ahead and pause the video and figure that out now. That number is the amount of hours you have left each week. But let's break that down into days. So you're going to pause the video one more time and divide by seven. That number is the time you actually own. Are you happy with that number? If the answer is no, no worries. Just click the link below this video and learn how you can own your time and own your life.